Hi everybody! In this video, I'm going to cover assessment plans. Assessment plans are linked to a qualification and are essentially a list of multiple assessments which form the plan. They allow you to quickly add many assessments to a class using customized dates. This video assumes you have created your assessment tasks and correctly mapped them to a qualification. To begin, mouse over the assessments menu and choose assessment plans. Now, press add assessment plan. Next, select the qualification you wish to create an assessment plan for, and then give the plan a name. Once complete, confirm via the button below to be taken to the update assessment plan page. All core and elective units against the qualification will be listed on the left. The numbers at the end of each row display the number of existing map links. Mousing over the numbers will highlight these maps. To add assessments, click the green plus icon next to each assessment task. Similarly, you can remove assessments by the delete icon that appears. Alternatively, you can click the bulk add mapped assessments button to add all mapped assessments to the current assessment plan. Next to the delete icon is an arrow to expand the assessment which will display the scheduling dates. You can update the dates by pressing the update scheduling button which will display the assessment scheduling menu. For explanations regarding this menu, please hover over the respective information bubbles. Each of the options available are dynamic and will change depending on the class this plan is applied to. You also have the ability to shift the date a set time period either before or after the initially selected dynamic time point. Once complete, click Save to view these scheduling changes against the assessment task. If you wish to include any assessment tasks which have not been mapped against the chosen qualification, you can do so by the drop down at the bottom of the page. When you finish customising the assessment plan, make sure you hit Save. Let's return to the assessment plans page via the button in the top left corner. I want to quickly demonstrate deactivating an assessment plan via the button on the right of the row. This will move it to the inactive tab, which can be toggled here. From the inactive tab, we can now either reactivate or delete assessment plans. In summary, this video has demonstrated how to create, update and delete assessment plans how to add assessments to a plan, and how to customise assessment scheduling. The following video will cover adding a plan to a class.